Hey, beautiful Libras. Welcome back to the channel, Libra. I want to pull on the goddess energies here and see what your messages are, Libra. Let's get to it. Whoa, the cosmic egg. Beautiful card to pull. The divine feminine. I hold the universe within me. I am the force of ever-expanding love. Dakini, the enlightened feminine. My gut instincts is wise beyond reason, and I trust my intuition to guide me. So let's go. Libra. Diana, the queen of the wilderness. The language of the, nor the natural world is my frequency of love. This is my mother tongue, Lakshmi, the goddess of abundance. I choose to feel abundant. Wealth is an inside job. <clears throat> the mystic of peace, Zhao Quan Jing. I am peace. When my mind is clear, the way is clear. Sarah Lakali, Queen of the Outsiders. I have arrived. I am where I'll always be in love. Bridget, the Goddess of Eternal Flame. I'm an eternal flame, and each day my light grows brighter. So you've got some beautiful goddess energies around you. You could be feeling like an outsider. You could have felt like you were in something, you know, by yourself. But in self, your light just gets stronger. It's like somebody may have treated you as an outsider or maybe you feel like you don't belong with other people. But you are exactly where you need to be. You are love. And your light only is getting brighter. Let's get to these messages. Some of you are right in tune with nature here. The goddess of abundance. I choose to be abundant. It's an inside job. So you may, somebody may have cut you off. You could have been isolated even from family, but you are love. You choose to be abundant. Even though somebody may have treated you poorly or wounded you, you still could have made you an outsider. This could have been like the black sheep of the family. This could be feeling like an outsider. It's a choice. It is a choice. This is sadness. This is depression. Feeling isolated. Feeling alone. Feeling cut off. Healing. Your light is only getting stronger. Very confident, very nurturing. So someone uh, may have treated you very poorly. Someone may have had like... Hmm...
someone may have tried to make you feel insecure about yourself. Someone may have tried to, I don't know if this is belittling or tried to lower your self-esteem. It's a choice. I This is an inside job. It's not on the outside. It's on the inside. Wealth is an inside job. Hmm. Someone is very hateful. Someone could be like looking externally. F looking, you know, externally instead of looking on their insides. Hmm. Could have been mocking, could have chose someone else. I don't know. Something is some kind of completion here. Hmm. It's like somebody could have pushed you away. I, I don't know. There's some kind of Read about home, worried about stability, feeling stuck. Hmm. Could have put you in a competition. Had to make a choice or a decision. <laughs> the Empress. Wealth is an inside job. It is not on the outside. So this person was definitely looking externally for some kind of like emotional void. Trying to fill an emotional void. But the truth is you'll not find it because it's an inside job. <laughs> this is karma. Someone could have judged you. They could have broke your heart. They could have walked away from you. You could have walked away from them. This is like... Yeah. Wealth. Maybe they were searching for wealth, but wealth is an inside job, not an outside job. So this person is... They were cheating. <laughs> they were cheating, but they cheated themselves out of true wealth. Because this person is seeking something externally. They could have been seeking wealth. External wealth. I'm not sure, but they're not going inside. <laughs> something superficial. A karmic, yeah. Superficiality. Juggling. See? This is someone who has grown spiritually. They're all about spiritual wealth. Good karma. This is someone who is accumulating good karma. This is someone who who knows that true wealth is an inside job. This is someone who knows true wealth comes from the inside out, not the outside in. Hmm. And they took action. Well... Superficial.
abandon a beautiful union for something superficial. Betrayed their true love for superficial reasons. But true love comes from the inside out. This is someone who chooses to be abundant. Chooses. Abundance is a choice. But just because someone has it on the outside doesn't mean that they're wealthy on the inside. On the inside, someone is void. Because somebody is truly truly abundant here inside themselves from the inside out and their light grows stronger each day so somebody betrayed a beautiful human being here for something superficial. Maybe for wealth. Maybe for, you know, status. <laughs> but they're poor on the inside. Because they do not have love. They are void on the inside. It's just like they threw away a love situation that could have made them very happy and threw it away for superficiality. That's what they did in this read. <laughs> and it's almost like they may have the money they may have the status, but they do not have the love. That's a lonely place. It's a lonely place. They're lonely. They're void. But it's a wealth is an internal job. This person needs to figure out what true wealth is. It's not what you have on the outside. It's what you have on the inside. How you treat people. How you respect people. How you appreciate. This person didn't have it. Take care.